Grant Sullivan at the point. 6'1 senior from Columbus, Ohio, transferred from Langston University. Sullivan for Rogers State. Pedal in the front court. Move left, down the lane. Left handed lamp coup. Cards up to the That's what he's good at. Of the game and has five points in the opening half. Driving Sullivan streaks to the basket. That went off the glass and in. Cats throws it up ahead and it goes to Spicer, to Sullivan. Three ball. Head of the circle. Hits it. Lance Sullivan with his third shot of the game to go. Circles throws it to Sullivan. Sullivan uses a screen from Marseille. Dribbles right. Sullivan to the bucket. He will dip in and score. Francis steps in, passes near corner, Sullivan, dribble drive, left baseline to the opposite side of the bucket. Left-handed ball handler throws it left side, and the three from Sullivan is up and through it. Bounds left to right for the Cats. Taylor to Sullivan. He wants a right wing three, and he hits the three. Ballot pass to the far side. Underhand Sullivan to Davis, and Davis puts it up and in. Up now to Sullivan, also on the floor, Boyd, Twilly, and Francis. And then now the youth play go. Sullivan, Sullivan pushes, he'll rotate it right side, back up to Boyd, head of the circle three. with the drive, and then Davis with the shot block. He has six in the game. Driving right, bucket. Rebounds and moves in the front court. Sullivan top of the key now. He'll step back, shoot a jumper, and rainbow it through a long two. Hillcats flood the front court. Top of the key. Burnett finds Sullivan. Three ball. Leads back for the Hillcats. Lance Sullivan with 28 big ones tonight. Graham to Brown. Lob in the post. Deflected by Francis. Just the tip of it with his fingertip tops. And Sullivan runs to the front court. Pull up 14 footer Drano. Watch this. His back gets turned to the basket. He shoots it backwards. I mean, I've, I've seen reverse layups before, but I've never seen one like that. That's a great job of keeping his concentration and getting that ball up there. And he still had two hands on the ball when he put it off the window. 